hi ladies how you are doing welcome back to my channel i hope you are all doing well it's been a while so today let's talk about how you can live in the moment how you can enjoy life but before then let me talk about my hair let me give a shout out to cheap hairs gh for this wonderful hair the hair is beautiful it's amazing you can see it you won't believe this hair is just 300 Ghana cities. It looks so fine. You can water it. You can put your oil, anything, and it's going to look fine on you. So, guys, check um, cheap underscore hair underscore GH on Instagram. Tell them you won't see kind of hair. Tell them you want the hair see what today. And she's going to give you exactly like this hair. That's if you like this hair. Or you can see other hairs on her page. She's got nice hair. She's one of my daughters. Let's support her let's grow her brand all right so without wasting time let's get into today's video now let's talk about life okay let's do a life talk let's talk about life all right so as you all know life is a beautiful thing this world is so beautiful life is sweet life is precious but life is very short tomorrow is not promised at all it's very short so you have to enjoy every bit of the moment some of you have been stressing your head too much you've been stressing yourself your mind and your head too much and it's not okay at all listen sis if you stress yourself too much if you overthink if you over worry you're gonna age so fast like you 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 are actually 20 be looking like 40 years i'm telling you go and ask anyone if you think too much you're going to age very fast okay some of you you are actually 20 years old you set goal for yourself you want to travel 10 countries you want to build a house own a car get married give birth to children before you get to 25 years old and you are 20. one you don't have a good job you don't have finances you don't have resources for that travel two you don't have a sponsor someone who is going to sponsor all those things three you don't even have hope let's say no i'm not saying that um you don't have like there is no one anywhere you are not even expecting anyone anywhere that's going to do these things for you now tell me aren't you stressing yourself just be honest to yourself aren't you stressing yourself you know there is no way you can achieve these things within five years. No, no. Listen, I'm not telling you that nothing is impossible, okay? Everything is possible. But there are some cases you just have to reason. You just have to think. In this case, you don't have anything. See, magic doesn't happen anywhere. Magic doesn't happen anywhere. Miracle can happen, no. Fine. <laughs> don't mind the noise i came to get fish so i'm waiting for the guy to bring it for me miracle can happen but see that miracle of you traveling 10 countries mm? buying house mm? getting cars mm? getting married mm? giving birth mm? before the age of 25 whilst you're 20 is one miracle that mm, it might happen no but i'm not sure it's gonna happen so stop stressing stop stressing and some of you ladies look let me not just say ladies both men and ladies this thing is applicable to both the genders we are thinking too much you see you see some people they are walking on the road hmm? they are talking to themselves it's not like they are crazy oh. but because of their problem they think about the problem uh, and now it all looks like they are crazy they are walking on the road See, I've met those kind of people. So many, you are you are blowing your horn. You will horn. Blah, 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 blah. They will not hear. You will think they have earpiece on their ears whilst they have nothing. They are gone. See, their mind is out of their body because they are thinking so much. See, take it slowly. Take it easy on yourself. You are going to achieve these things. Yes, but don't give yourself a deadline. That's the word. Do not give yourself a deadline and say, I must get these things before this time. Because since if you don't get it, you're going to be disappointed with yourself. And you're going to think you're a failure. And since, listen, the moment you start thinking you're a failure, then since you're automatically a failure, I am telling you, stop thinking too much. 
cut everything down. Cool your head. Go to the bar. Grab a bottle of beer. Drink and relax. Problem not a finish. So you, you be thinking too much, too much, too much. Do you know how I know about this? Because I, I am a spiritualist, right? And people bring their problems to me every day. Every day I get more than 20 new messages. Like new people every day. And one of the messages is always mc i want to do this before i get to this age oh time is going who told you time is going since you're not owing anybody your time your life is not in anybody's hand your life is in god's hands let me tell you every new day brings new opportunity meaning if there is something you weren't able to achieve today by the time you wake up tomorrow you can still try again and who knows tomorrow might just be your day but if you think about this thing do you know the rate high bp is killing people now go to the hospital i currently started dating a guy who was a doctor so i was <laughs> i've said it out <laughs> yeah i started dating a guy who was a doctor so i always go to his office sometimes because me too i'm having issues because i go to the gym so i start having issues with my knee so i go to the office see i meet people bp high bp do you know i even started advising people in the hospital i'm like what's up if you know the rate high BP is killing people now, you will pity on yourself. Take it easy. Do you know sometimes when you think and you think, maybe in the night, you think and think and think and think and think, you go to bed, you catch cardiac arrest, or what do you call it? You get cardiac arrest, or is that how they pronounce it? Yes. And you just pass out, God forbid. And if there's no one there to help you, you pass out and you're gone. That is what high BP could do to you. And what brings IBP? Overthinking, over worry. Stop tying your happiness to someone. Stop tying your happiness to something. Why? Just be happy. Look for something, engage yourself. If you know how to dance, look for money. Go and enroll yourself in a dance class. If you know how to sing, go for singing um, school. Look for something, swim, go to the beach. See, look for something to find happiness in. Now I'm directing this to my single ladies because my single ladies depression is killing you people. See, they, see, I've read the Bible. Even if I'm a spiritualist, I've read the Bible. There is nowhere in the Bible that says that if you don't get married, you go to hellfire. It is nowhere in the Bible. So why are you people killing yourself because of marriage? This marriage that marriage. This? Aren't you seeing the whites? Aren't you seeing the Americans? They, see, they are. The, the whites, some of them, they are 50 years, 70. See, I belong to so many groups on Facebook filled with Oyibo people, like Americans. Hmm? You see somebody celebrating 70th birthday, no married, no kids. They are still happy as fuck. And you see them looking like 20, looking that, like 30, unless they tell you their age. That's because they don't allow their problems overshadow them. They don't allow their problem cover them. Sis, look, just relax your mind. Relax your mind. If you don't get married today, you will get married tomorrow. If you don't get married this year, next year is for you. Why do you want to kill yourself today? Because of something you know that you can even get tomorrow. That's why they say nobody knows tomorrow. Tomorrow might be good, tomorrow might be bad. Why don't you enjoy today? Live your life today. Live it to the fullest. Enjoy. Most of you, you've not orgasm before. You've not come as a woman. But when a man stays on top of you, the man will come. But you as a woman, you've not come before. Is that right? When you get into a relationship, when you go into a new relationship, instead of you to think about how you use the man to satisfy yourself, you'll be thinking about how to marry, how the man will marry you. When you just enter a relationship, it's only marriage, marriage, marriage. Why don't you think about vacations, restaurants, new cocktail bars, new things you could go, salsa dance, Take your man to Afrikiko. Go and do salsa. Go and do things. Why do you think about that? Must it always be about marriage? What is even in the marriage that you people want to kill yourself over? Go to the central court. People are divorcing every day. See what is going on online. People are crying. People are rushing out of marriage. And you want to kill yourself because you are not married? Why don't you take it easy on yourself? Since today I'm telling you to calm down. I know we are all looking for money to do this, to do that. But please take a break. Calm down. Relax. Why your kakra kakra? Relax. 
it's okay. If it doesn't come today, it is fine. It will come tomorrow. If it doesn't happen today, it's okay. Perfectly okay. It will come tomorrow. That is why we have tomorrow. God made you to sleep today and wake up tomorrow morning because there is something for you tomorrow. Be appreciative of what you have today because there is someone out there who wants to be where you are today that they cannot be there. And you that you were there because you've not gotten to where you want to be, you are not appreciating where you are currently. When you appreciate God, I'm not preaching to you, but I'm telling you the truth. When you appreciate God for what he did for you today, tomorrow he's going to do more. God loves gratitude. God loves grateful people. When you are grateful for what you have, it's going to give you more. If you are a single mother, take care of your child. Be happy with your child. Stop complaining, complaining, complaining. You get it. God is going to give you a way that you train your child. God is going to give you a help that will help you train your child. God is going to help you. Even if you're not a single mother, you're single. Your problem is relationship. You want to get married. Since if you get into a relationship, enjoy the relationship. If you see a guy that you like, see, don't be shy to approach a guy. Tell him, oh, can we be friends? Just know that you're not going to catch feelings. Because if you start catching feelings, then he will take advantage of you approaching him first. Just be sure you, you are not going to catch feeling. But if you know you are an emotional person, then don't do this. But if you are someone like me, I've buried my emotions long ago, I can easily approach any guy and say, hey, can we hang out? Can we have fun? That's it. If he wants to charge me, fine. How much are you going to take? That's it. I mean, he's going to make you come. You will come. You see these ladies that are always smart in their shouts. Every little, little thing piss them off. It's because they don't come. They don't orgasm. If you don't orgasm, sis, every smart thing, you'll be shouting, shouting, you'll be quarreling, you'll be angry, you'll be mad. But sis, if you always come, if you orgasm, you're just going to take life. Mm. You're not going to take life that serious, you know? You're not going to take life too serious. Sis, it's okay. I know someone is out there who needs to hear this. That's what I'm telling you today. It's okay. We are going to make money. But sis, try and be happy. Do not tie your happiness to any Putin or anybody because human beings can change. You don't know. Human, see, you see me in my hood where I live. Today I might be passing there. Then you will greet me. Auntie Precious, good morning. I'll be like, yeah, how are you doing? Tomorrow when you greet me, the way I will answer you. It will look like you and I will be fighting for years. That is, that is human being for you. So if you are tying your happiness to human being. <laughs> tomorrow the human being will just stand some of you will say oh i don't know how to do this i don't know start it i don't know how to go out start going out if you know you stay alone in the house no staying alone in the house you can be depressed and excuse me if you're always living alone in the house and you always think about your problems and there's no one to discuss it with then you'll be depressed then go out like me I stay with my daughter, but my daughter is in school. She's in boarding school, so she doesn't come home. So anytime I know that, oh, I have something bothering me, you know what I do? I just get into the car, I drive out. Some of you will be like, oh, because you have a car. You can also go out. You can pick a taxi. You can, sometimes I don't even go out with my car. I take a taxi or I take a stroll. I walk around. I'll just put like 50 dollars in my pocket. I'll walk around. And when I see a small, uh, what do they call it, a Google joint, a potential joint, I'll sit down there, take one or two thoughts. See, I'm okay, I'm fine. I'll go to my house and sleep. That's all. Tomorrow we continue. You get it. So please, I know this is for someone. Are you a man? Are you a woman? And you are seeing this video. Please do not take life too serious. High BP kills faster than any other thing. Your problems are going to be solved. Your problems is going to get a solution. But that solution is not going to come when you kill yourself over that problem. Calm down. Be grateful to God for what you have today. For he's going to do more for you tomorrow. Alright ladies. So that will be all for today. I hope this helps one person out there or more. Alright. Take care of yourself. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you're new. Don't forget to give me this thumbs up. Leave your comments what you think. And also share my video. Turn on your notification. Because see if I don't post the link on my WhatsApp. So many people don't know when I'm uploaded. But by the time you've turned your notification. Anytime I, I upload, bam, you're going to hear it first. All right, guys. <laughs> My fish is ready. Let me go get it. It's already five. I have to go to the gym. Take care of yourself. Stay safe. Do not let anyone 
steal your joy.